sisters, how y'all doing today? Come on in, y'all, because I'm coming in and sit with y'all right now. Hey, hey, I'm coming in with y'all. I'm taking my seat to... Mm. Hey, y'all. Come on in. Bring your Kool-Aid, your cocktail, your water. Bring your food and snacks. Let's sit and chat with who? Me. That's hood, girl, to the hood. Y'all see what the movie is today? It's just food. Good leftovers from my house and David and house. Y'all, this is a scene two because it's the second time I've eaten it. And, oh, take one. Let's roll the tape. Come on in, y'all. How y'all doing on this Tuesday day? Uh, I hope y'all had a great, good, long weekend and celebrated uh, MLK Day together as many as you could. Uh, I know we have to be safe from COVID, but let's say prayers, toast, and eat in that order. <laughs> Thank you, God, for this another day. Thank you for divine mercy, grace, love, and forgiveness. Healing, my God, heal the brokenhearted, Father, the sick and the shut in, broken marriages, sad children. My God, we need you more now than ever, but we need you every day. Let this food be nourishment to my beautiful and healthy body. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen and amen. That's it, y'all. This is a, a new week. Just love each other, okay? Salud, salud. Let's sip, sip this good water. Cheers. I love y'all. Y'all know that. Thank y'all for sticking and staying with me. Y'all, sometimes I can't get enough of water, but that's a good thing, true. Because my uh, whale well woman is coming up, and so we're going to have to see what the kidney levels are now because uh, I'm drowning in this water. I'm going to need the levels to go back up. Y'all, so this food that we have, it's just a mixture. We have corn, and that's from David M. House yesterday. They smoked it on the pit. I have some smoked a boudin. I have my, now my food is the potatoes and, and the uh, chicken, y'all know that. And then I got some macaroni and cheese right here. And then, of course, y'all, in this right here, uh, I came home with some um, cake, Louisiana crunch cake, that is, and some butter pound cake, y'all. Y'all see that? Can y'all see that? No, y'all can't see that. Let open that up. Yeah, that it is. So that's some good goods right there. Mm-hmm. So, I'm at lunch uh, right now, y'all. I'm, I'm on a new team, as y'all know. We still training by ourselves. We don't have our uh, log-ons right now either, so it's kind of hard to follow the training unless you got your hands on it. I'm a hands-on girl. Yeah, in my personal life and my professional life, I'm hands-on. Just know that. So, how did y'all celebrate MLK? I was not going to do anything. Uh, I was going to watch a whole lot of black movies about MLK, Martin Luther King, and all the other leaders. Um, and then David called me. He said, Mama, can you come over? And Okay, I will, baby. And uh, it was five, six of us, I want to say, and a couple of little babies. And... Uh, Two pregnant women, whatever, you know, amongst us as well. Of course, when they become barbecue, they barbecue. They really do. This is good. And um, we ate, we danced, we talked, yeah, played games. We just loved on each other. You know, that's important today. My God, today. Of course, you know, I was telling them youngsters, get your life together. 
The leftovers are good. Because I didn't eat my food yesterday because I was at David and her. But I ate a piece of that boudin last evening when I got home. And at Nikki House. That boudin is delicious, y'all. And David smoked it really good. Mm hmm Yeah, my birthday coming. Um, we have a few beaches here. Uh, not too far. I'm trying to figure out if I want to just stick where I am. You know, just get a beach house or something. And do a girls trip. You know, just four of us. I don't know. I'm thinking about it. I got... One month to figure it out because I have to get my room. I want a beach view as well. So I think that's what I'm going to do. Steady. Because we have like six beaches right here by me. Mm -hmm. So I mean, you know, not like right by me. You know, one of them is an hour away, others are two hours, maybe three hours. Another one is like four hours. So I don't think I'm going to drive long, but I want the water and I want to get out of my house, you know. We can stay in a room and all the food in and drink and dance, you know, and look at the water, sit on the balcony because. I want the, the room to have a balcony as well. If y'all know I'm going to do some cigars. Video. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> y'all know when I did that Jamaican food? Um... They was cooking it fresh that day. Well, they cook it fresh every day. But, y'all, the next day I, I ate the leftovers. My God, them seasonings, them Jamaican seasonings sat in. Man, I'm thinking, like, I can't wait to go back. I cannot wait to go back. I think I'm going to get the jerk wings this time. Mm-hmm. Mm, damn. <laughs> That's good, y'all. So, did y'all, how many of y'all barbecue yesterday? And did y'all have a couple of people at your house in your backyard? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know what? I did not offer y'all anything. Let me give y'all some of this good old smoked corn. That corn was good. I ate one last night. Yeah, yeah, give me some. Of course. That's hot. That smoke boot in. Mm hmm You know, and Nikki from Louisiana as well. Mm. Nikki cooked some shrimp yesterday. Ooh. Those shrimp were banging good. My God, they were so good. Mm. Yeah, this is good. <laughs> mm -hmm. And this is just lunch. <laughs> but y'all, I found some crackers. Because sometimes if I eat lunch like this, I don't want a heavy dinner. And then y'all already know I'm still on two boiled eggs in the morning as well. So I found these crackers. Just for the nights, I don't want to eat. But I know you have to eat on something. So I, buy, I found these crackers, y'all. And I remember buying them many years ago. But I found them again. So I bought, I bought a box of them. So uh, I can snack on something like that. 
and some fruit, you know. Mm-hmm. This is good. This booty in is hitting now. Nikki's gonna have to give me tell me where she bought this booty at from. But they went to uh, Louisiana, so surely uh, this came from Louisiana. Mm, mm. And sometimes y'all might eat them two eggs in the morning, depending on what time I eat them. Sometimes, um, this time of day, I be so hungry. If I eat my eggs at 8 o'clock in the morning, I'll be hungry at noon, for real. And when I eat them a little later, I really don't have a big lunch at all. I probably have a, some kind of crackers or something snacky. And then I'll have dinner. I haven't even bit my coin, y'all. Mm. You know, y'all, um, when you're training, looking at slides, you know, do you get bored? <laughs> because, you know, nobody is actually talking and showing you stuff you know, and the Excel files, and I'm bored. <laughs> I'm really bored. Mm -hmm. But I got to do it. Until they give us the sign on with all those systems, the systems. <sighs> Y'all, you, you know, really, when I look back over my life, I've come a long, long way. And when I think about where I am today, I just say, God, you know what? Every day is different. If you're blessed to see another day, you just don't know what's going to happen, you know. In your family life, in your job life, your children's life, you just don't know. And Nikki told me last night, she walked me to the car. And she said, Mama, I just want you to know. Everybody loves you here. Yeah. And I can tell, because when I walk in, the hugs I get, they don't let me go. They really don't. They hold on to me so tight when they hug me, you know? Nikki's family, they just hug me so tight. And it feels good. So she told me last night, the reason they do that it's because my love or the hugs I give them, they feel something. Every time I put my arm around them, I'm like, oh, wow. It's just the spirit. It's alive and well in me, and I, I love that. I love that God uses me, you know? Even when I don't even know when he's going to use me, he uses me. And uh, she said, I've never had uh, a mother-in-law like you before. Well, honey. Because everybody's not one need a hood. You know? I'm better today than I ever have been. You know, all of our journeys are different. My childhood life was bad. But God gave me grace to get through it. And he brought me through it. I've had love and I lost love, you know. I played and been played. Mm. That smoke flavor is so good in here. Mm. 
I've been happy and I've been sad. But y'all know what I really want to do? I got that corn all over my mouth. What I really want to do is buy a building with four apartments, y'all. I know I said it the other day, but it's on my heart to put everybody live together, you know. But, you know, in your own space, you know, in your own apartment, in the same building, you know. That's what I want. Mm. That's good. Mm-hmm. Mm. I'm so happy with this death dog. Booty now. Nicky got to give me some, some, some links to put in my uh, freezer so when I want some, I can just take them down, y'all. Mm, this is good. Mm. I'm getting full. But I'm cleaning my plate. That's for sure. Do any one of you have one really heartfelt desire that you want to see manifest in your life or in your children's life, family life? Mine is that building. Mm -hmm. mm. I need some salt. And it's corn. You know, I like uh, frozen corn very rarely. Is there something about fresh corn that's so much better? This is good because, you know, it's full. But it's frozen. And frozen corn, if you pick it right, it's so damn sweet and good. Mm-hmm. Whew. Well, I have 30 more minutes until my lunch break is over. So I guess I'll look at some RV companies. Well, you know what? With the van life and the RV life, it's something about that van I like because it's smaller, you know, and I can maneuver that sucker and back up and all that other stuff. Mm hmm. I knew it, y'all. I knew it, y'all. I always belch at the end, don't I? <laughs> but anyway, I'm leaning more to the van life. So, y'all, if it's God's will, I'll be doing van tours. You know, I'll have my main house, but I will be traveling. I want to see the world. You know, how much can God use me outside of this house? My God. Let's sing, y'all. You ready? It's time to say goodbye for now. We have another chance to round together. It's a unity. On the other side. <laughs> Whatever you do uh, for today and this evening, do it with your family, do it with love, do it with purpose, and genuine love. I love you guys. Bye-bye.